Sources within the Chicago Police Department tell us that Eddie Johnson and his wife did get into a verbal argument inside their home last night that escalated and then that Johnson shoved his wife. Police sources confirm there was a call made to 911 from Eddie Johnson's Bridgeport home around 930 last night, describing it as a domestic incident. The department says there were no injuries, that the victim refused medical attention, and no arrests were made. A source close to Eddie Johnson, who spoke with the former superintendent this morning, confirmed Johnson said that he and his wife did have an argument in their home near 33rd Place and Racine Avenue last night, but that they have since made up and have been together today. Johnson is married to Chicago Police Lieutenant Nakia Fenner. Last week, Johnson was sued by CPD officer Cynthia Donald, his former driver, who alleged that Johnson sexually harassed and assaulted her for more than three years. Johnson has denied those allegations. The former superintendent was fired after an October 2019 drinking and driving incident where he was found asleep behind the wheel of his SUV after seen out with Donald at a downtown bar. An inspector general's report says Johnson consumed the equivalent of 10 drinks before he got into his vehicle. There was talk earlier today that Johnson might possibly be coming here to the 9th district to speak with detectives or possibly turn himself in after this incident. But at this point, his wife does not appear to be pressing charges. In Bridgeport, Dana Revick, WGN News.